Well, today is Friday, August 18th. It's about 11.10 in the morning. Coming up to uh, do a solo sail today down to Chicago. I'm gonna stay at Montrose Harbor. Tomorrow, we'll meet up with some friends and we're gonna go out and watch the Chicago Air and Water Show. And then Sunday, I'll sail back. So hopefully it'll be a great weekend. Two nights in Montrose Harbor. Haven't stayed there yet, but uh, hopefully that'll be comfortable. And as usual, when I solo, I'm gonna go ahead and run a jack line um, around the boat and wear a harness while I'm out. It's 11.36, just docked off. Right now the winds, at least in here, are very light. They're supposed to be 10 to 15 on the lake. Decided to leave the uh, big jib up, big gentle up. Winds are gonna be out of the west-northwest, so beam reaching and broad reaching with the big gentle up. I haven't done that yet in high winds, so we'll see how that goes. Well, it's 12.06. Put the sails up about 10 minutes ago, but still had the engine going because the winds were down at around five. Winds just picked up to 10. Okay, we're doing about, uh, remember that's at 4.7 to five knots. We're on a broad reach right now. We have 10 knots to win on a broad reach the whole way to Chicago. That would be pretty good. Well, got uh, sails up, heading towards Chicago. Winds are about 12, coming on about uh, 140 degrees off our stern, or our starboard, so we're broad reaching right now. Doing about four and a half to uh, six knots. 
Hopefully this will last the entire way down to a great sale. That's 1238. Going about five knots to six knots. Winds have shifted slightly. So we're uh, on a beam reach now. Picked up a little bit of speed. Winds right now are still about 12. First wave point is a um, marker off Wilmette, WR2. We're about 13 and a half miles from that. Get there around uh, 11.30 at this rate. Or 3.30, I should say, at this rate. About 107. Winds are about 11 knots still. Beam reaching. We're doing it between five and a half, 5.8 knots. Doing pretty good time. Off in the distance, every once in a while, I think I hear a uh, a jet plane, a fighter plane. They're supposedly uh, practicing on the lakefront today. So it is possible I could be hearing them. But they're not this far north yet. I will be down close by at around 4.30, but I guess that will be too late for the practice. It's 130. Winds are about 10 and a half to 11. Going five and a half to six knots. Still on a beam reach. Full sail. Sunny skies. Weighs about one foot. Doesn't really get any better than this.
It's about 234. Winds are down though about six knots. Speed's down to three, three and a half. We're about 13.6 miles into the trip. I've got another 4.3 miles to my first waypoint, which is a marker off Wilmette, WR2. Right now, with the speed slowing down, looks like I won't get to a WR2 until about 3.50. Hopefully the wind will pick back up again shortly. Up until this point, we've been doing uh, pretty good, five knots plus. But the wind's just uh, tailed off a little bit. I think maybe I should check the forecast to see if they've changed it. Let's start to see uh, Chicago and the horizon pretty good. Two thirty-seven. Winds are down to about uh, four and a half knots. Boat speed's about 1.7. I just checked. There's a buoy off of Wilmette. And it says there the speeds of the wind are right around 11 knots. So hopefully I'll get that soon. But not much wind right here right now. It's about 250, winds pick back up again. Right now they're about eight knots. I'm doing about four and a half. That's much better. Looking uh, out to the city ahead there, I can see it's the uh, Blue Angels doing their practice. Can't get it on camera, but I can see tiny dots flying around on the horizon. I'm doing uh, all kinds of acrobatics. Pretty cool. It's about 319. Winds have picked back up nice. About 9.6 knots true. We're doing over five knots now. We got about 16.3 miles behind us. And we're coming up to our first waypoint, which is about a one and a half miles ahead, which is the uh, Wilmet WR2. See the uh, Baha'i Temple. That's in Evanston, Illinois. And the uh, Chicago skyline is getting bigger and bigger all the time. Well, it's about 341. The winds are about eight and a half to nine knots. We're doing four and a half to five. Just passing our first uh, waypoint, WR2, here off of uh, Wilmette. Be changing course slightly. We were at about 160 degrees. Now we've got to change to about a 173, or I should say 176. We got about nine more miles to go to the uh, Montrose Harbor Marina. At 410, winds have picked up to 13 or so. Thinking along at six to six and a half knots. Seven. Still on a beam reach. About five and three quarter miles from our uh, Mark off of Montrose Harbor, and then another three quarters of a mile after that.
it's about 435. Winds just shifted a bit. We're coming out of the west southwest, so we're kind of close hauled now. Only got about three and a half miles till we get to our waypoint that's just west of the harbor. And once we get there, I'll go ahead and turn the engine on, drop the sails, get ready to go in. That point's about three quarters of a mile before the harbor entrance. Looking along at about five and a half knots now, close haul. Five o'clock. Winds are about 12. We're doing five, five and a half. Winds are kind of uh, variable right now in, in that they're switching from the west to the west southwest and gusting. So I got about 1.3 miles. I get to my uh, next mark, which is right outside the Montrose Harbor. That's where I'll go ahead and turn the motor on, drop the sails, and get ready to go in. I have uh, gone ahead and put a couple of the fenders out and uh, got my mooring lines ready. Like a Boy Scout, I'm prepared. It's 527, about uh, 0.4 miles from the Montrose Harbor entrance. A 26 and a half miles so far and average about 4.6 knots. That looks like a classic right there.
Well, right now it's 706. Trip is 27.4 miles. Took me six hours and 18 minutes to dock off and then tie up here at Montrose Harbor. I guess with the slow motoring in, my average went from 4.6 when I first dropped the sails to about 4.3 by the time I tied up. Well, it's about 9 o'clock. Relaxing here at the uh, Montrose Harbor. Definitely a lot quieter than the 31st Street Harbor was last year. Not, I mean, you got your city noises, but you don't have uh, people on their boats blasting million watts worth of music because they think everybody else in the harbor wants to hear it. So hopefully that's the way it'll be for the rest of the evening. It'll be very uh, comfortable to stay. Um, when I got here, the dock I tied up to, L29, looked like it hadn't been used by a human in a long time, but definitely had, uh, let's say, the remnants of a lot of ducks or geese. It was terrible. So I actually spent the first half hour after I tied up cleaning off the crap off of the dock. I would have hoped that the, uh, the harbor employee staff would have uh, taken care of that sort of thing. but. That was pretty gross, but I cleaned that up. And the uh, I'm on L dock, and the showers are over on F dock, which is down and around the uh, the harbor area. So it's a it's a nice little hike. They're not the cleanest bathrooms around, um, but uh, usable. Not too gross that you wouldn't use them anyway. So anyway, now I got my wine out. And uh, hopefully we'll have a good night's sleep. And then the uh, air show tomorrow. It's supposed to get some rain tonight. So we'll see uh, how bad that gets.